The women and men of the Postal Inspection Service are proud to have been an important part of the Law Enforcement Explorer Conference in Flagstaff, Arizona. We have prepared this commemorative video especially for you, the attendees. The conference was such a success thanks to the hard work of hundreds of volunteers from law enforcement at all levels, from the military, from suppliers, and from dedicated individuals. We all believe in you as our future leaders. I would like to pay special tribute to the Boy Scouts of America, the staff of Northern Arizona University, and to the Arizona Department of Public Safety, so ably directed by Joe Albo, our conference chairman. All of us thank you, the attendees, for making it such a success. We look forward to seeing you in 1998 at the next Law Enforcement Explorer Conference. I guess it's time for me to say, kind of getting close to the end of my time right now. I got one week left, and let me tell you something. It's gonna be one week you're never gonna forget. I'm gonna be out there with you explorers, doing every event if I can, time permitting, but I'm gonna be out there working with the people that I love and care about. I started back in law enforcement exploring when I was 13 years old, and I can't believe I'm 20 years old now. I wanna thank my parents. At age 13, they used to have to get me up early to take me to do traffic control, to take me to do whatever the explorers wanted me to do. I was gung-ho to do it. And never once did my parents say, hey, you know, we can't do that for you. We can't help you out. We can't help you with the money or anything. They are always stood by there. And I'll tell you what, it's not easy having a person like me in a family. I'm here. I'm going here and there, and I, I'm, I'm just a person. I'm never at a loss for words, as you can tell, because I'm not reading a script right now. And this is the real Vinnie Montez you have up here. We love you, Vinnie! <laughs> Last but not least, I just want to tell my parents, Mom and Dad, my parents are sitting up here with my brother and my girlfriend. Mom and Dad, I love you very much. And Explorers, thank you. And I'll tell you what, I got one hell of a week left with you guys, and we're going to do it. It's really my honor and privilege to be here to attend the opening of your Law Enforcement Explorer Conference. For the last couple of years, Ken Hunter has been telling me about the excitement and enthusiasm that is, surrounds these events. And I, and I have to say, as descriptive of he, as he's been, uh, it really, uh, words just haven't done it justice. This has been very, very impressive. Your personal integrity is the most valuable asset that you have your reputation, and you have to take responsibility for your reputation. When other people question your integrity, they're really telling you that they don't have confidence in you. Their confidence in you and your self-confidence is what will help you excel. But I really want to emphasize, many of you will go on right now, you're wearing uniforms and you're representing the Law Enforcement Explorer program, and your reputation is something that you have to take responsibility for and that you have to develop. And each and every day, you need to work on that. It's the most important credential you'll ever carry, no matter what you do. Make effective use of your time this week. Learn all you can about law enforcement this week from the best people you can learn from, the people that actually do it every day. They're here to work with you and they're here to guide you. Demonstrate your leadership qualities and your physical abilities, but don't lose sight of being a team player. You're, you're the role models and you're the heroes. We really all look up to you and, and are very, very proud of you. So have a great week. And last but not least, 
have fun. Thank you very much. I've been involved with law enforcement exploring for four years now, and I currently serve as captain of the Santa Barbara Police Department Explorer Program. As youth representative, I would like to continue to make law enforcement exploring more of a positive direction and continue to make it a great experience for us all. My goals as a youth representative are, one, to enhance communication. Second, build leadership with post leaders. The way to do this is to provide leadership training in local councils for post leaders. And third, build a large and productive youth staff. We are about 75% there with over 40 staff members nationally. The staff is designed to communicate with posts in their area and to generate ideas and concerns to the national youth rep to address at national meetings. And fourth, promote national activities, as it can increase the opportunities for explorers nationally to get involved with conferences, academies, workshops, and more. And I believe that realistically we can accomplish this. So I'm asking that you vote for me on Thursday so that we can move exploring in a positive direction for us all. Thank you and good luck in this week's activities.
If only I could see 